Is that the Geico Gecko? I'm, I'm almost positive it is. My family calls it my superpower. It's my ability to see value in things that other people might overlook. Sometimes I go picking with my boyfriend, sometimes it's my best friend Sue, and sometimes it's my kids. But at the end of the day, it's all about having fun and hopefully just maybe making a profit. Action. All right, well, we are at uh, the Goodwill. The parking lot is really full. We had to park way out. We did. Oh, yes. We must some... be having a, a sale or something. Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> well, we're going to go in and find out if there's anything left for us. Hopefully. We'll always find something. That's true. That's what we do. We find <laughs> stuff other people don't find. But I'd love to see what's going on in there, what brought this big crowd. Yes, let's hope that we can find Casey and ask her to turn the music down because the last video, I did get a copyright strike and I had to pull the video down and wipe it and put overlay music and then put it back up. It was horrible. Oh my word. Yeah, For well. For the like, first 10 seconds of the video before she turned the music down. Unbelievable. I don't know why they get so fussy YouTube. About that. Anyway, we're gonna go in and see what we can find that we can flip for a profit. All right, and Here we'll we see you inside. Hmm, we've got an optic brandy snifter for $2.99. I'll take it. Even if it is amber. I have nothing against amber. It's just not my favorite, that's all. Hmm, those are modern. I think they're modern. Let's see, let's see. Those are cute. We have enough china though. We're just gonna look at the mark. Royal china. Ooh, those are nice. Again, we have too much china. I'm gonna stop now. I'm gonna stop, I can't help myself. Just can't help myself. All right. Now this is a total bummer as I almost knock off his other horn. He's totally stuck there. That's probably how he lost his horn. Not gonna lie. Darn it. He's marked Diana 1922. That's the date on there, 1922. That's probably how he lost his horn. That's actually really cool. And the date on there just totally makes it. Darn. There's really no saving that with a chip like that. I'm right, you know what? We'll put him on the top shelf. Boom. There we go. Hmm. What in the world? Avon. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep going. All right, so, so that is the brown section. We always start with the brown section. Let's do blue. Well, I didn't really see much in blue, I'm gonna be honest. I was kind of glancing at blue as I was showing you guys. Oh, look. Oh, those are Sue's bowls. Those are the bowls that Sue redonated. Hmm. All right. Like I said, there's not much going on in the blue. I'm so disappointed that this is like cracked and then re-glued. It's marked Goebel. <sighs> what a bummer. Oh, hello. Where is your saucer? Oh, you're so pretty. I'm gonna put this in here and then maybe we'll find the saucer to go with it. That's plastic. I thought maybe that was glass, and it is not. Hmm. 
Ooh, milk glass vases with fake flowers in them. Ah, uh, let's take them in for a moment. All right, I'm done. Let's go back to the green. Is our bowl still here? Do we see our bowl? A lot of you have noticed that I always put the candlestick back in the bowl, but I think it's finally gone. I think somebody finally bought it because I'm not seeing it here. I did that like three times in a row without saying a single word. And it's finally gone. I just found I'm so excited let's see if it's all here there's the little little guy goes here no that's not right um wait I don't know I don't know what I'm I don't know what's happening right now and then he goes here okay, wait a minute this is the big one yes this is so this one goes with this one yeah but wait this guy goes right here and he needs to go like that right are we missing one, one? here's the little one but th that's this that's the guy seems too little Right here. Yes. Here. Ta-da! Oh, it's a shame it's in such bad shape. I was really excited when I found it. It's ninety-seven cents. Oh, I guess I'll take it for ninety-seven cents. It's I like a fun say, vintage yes. decoration, although it does still have its original sticker on the bottom that says, "Hi, I'm modern, made to look old." Ah. Hmm. You know what, you are a lot of work to put back together, but somebody will appreciate you. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, Sue, so what do you have here? Well, let me start. I'm not, Holy smokes! Yeah. This is what happens when I waste my time doing other stuff. Yes, you turned your back on me and I'm shopping. <laughs> this is a nice set. I like five those. Five Japan. If it were six, I would jump on this I'd still go for it. You think? Yes. Well, yeah. It's I have a family of five. Three dollars. All right, that's true. Careful it doesn't fall through your slots there, so. Yeah, I know, I gotta. That makes me nervous. I need to clear out in there a little. This is an interesting little vase. It's got that sticker, which does not make me crazy, but also, I suspect that sticker was a later addition because right here we have hand-painted, and that's actually. right in the piece yeah so i don't know if that i feel like that's modern then that stays thank you see look you're this welcome a valuable this is not a waste of my time <laughs> this is nice. i saw that and i thought of you and then i left it's, it there because i knew you'd find it well it's fairly modern <laughs> it's only two dollars it's not really old but it's vintage yes but it's a nice piece and i like the colors and also it's a very good size mm -hmm. for a small planter so, if you like it, then it stays. So, now we're starting to make space. This is $2, made in Japan. I don't think... We're not broken. Are we broken? No, we're not. Watch out behind you. <laughs> we have asymmetrical handles. So, we're not broken. Just. Our handles are asymmetrical, but that's a nice little piece for two bucks. Yeah, two bucks. All right. It's a little piece of lusterware for a dollar. I don't know. I think it's modern. Hmm, I think it might be. I'm not seeing any wear on it. The problem with these mm -hmm. little feet is who knows? how long they've been on. Yeah. So I don't know, what do you think? Uh, personally, I would pass, but we have different tastes, so. Well, I'm not keeping it for myself. Okay, okay, all right. These, you just saw me grab. Yes. These are staying, these are Noritake cream soup bowls. Um, so, they're staying for $2, mm -hmm. absolutely. <laughs> this is a little two dollar candy dish it's definitely got some age to it you know you don't get that kind of grubbiness overnight and also it's a style that's been around for a long long time 
So I figured that's a good one. A pocket. Got all its fingers and toes. Mm -hmm. It's not marked. I don't think it's Japanese, although it has that look. But definitely older. So that's one. This. I actually have a little violet. Well, that it's a square. Yeah. I have a, a little violet piece. Yeah, I'm <laughs> okay. Bye. Bye. All right. Here's the piece. I have a little violet dish that's a little bit larger than this that has already been drilled for a tidbit tray. Ah. So I'm seeing this as the top, the other one is the middle, and then eventually a nice violet plate for the bottom. So that's just going to go into my box for whenever. What do you think? It's a lamp. It is. <laughs> Definitely. It is a $3 lamp. It seems to be damage-free, filthy. 1940s? That's what I'm thinking. Uh, nice 1940s is a hard sell. You think? I do. I don't buy 1940s. So I appreciate I it, but I don't buy it for a resale. You think I should leave it? Mm, I would. All right. Well, <laughs> I wouldn't be asking your opinion if I didn't <laughs> want it. It would be a nice project lamp for one of your videos, though. That's the thing. For you, it's a different purpose than for me. For me to resale that, resell that. But and for you to put together a lamp and make it into a lamp. We will keep that as a project okay. piece. Yes. Now, what do you think of this little bugger? I think it's cute. I was debating, I saw that on the shelf. I was debating whether or not, I believe it's modern made to look old. I don't know. Mm. I mean, it's not very modern. Yeah, it's I think it's vintage. But I don't think it's actually sure. flow blue. No. I don't know. I like it. I like it. I like it for a yeah, back. I do too. Alright, so. I think you did good. All I've right. got just two things in mind. And I've only got one of them because I'm still looking for the little saucer to go with it. I don't think I'm gonna find it. I saw this. Piece. Oh, I want the saucer so bad. This is a really, really sweet piece. When I looked at this, uh, my first thought was, what can I turn this into? It's so pretty. It is beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Absolutely. We just need a saucer to go with it. And of course, a brandy snifter. That's it. That's all I've got. An optic amber one. I might be willing to part with this one because normally I hold on to them. Oh, yeah. Oh, I, never, I never even got this on video. But you would grab this yes, for me at the I very beginning. I thought you would like that because those are little hound dogs. <laughs> I love it. I mean, I think they're... They, they are. They look like blue to me, so... I love them. I mean, am I right? Is yes, that, oh, absolutely. Looks like? Absolutely. I know blind ladies <laughs> trying to describe a dog. That looks I like I love blue. them. Like these mugs. They look like they could be Otagiri. I saw some those. That them. was exactly what I thought. <laughs> I said they are Otagiri, and they have lost their stickers. I think they are. Yes. I like them. I like that they have wildflowers on them. We're going to grab I those. I too. I thought they were lovely. Mm-hmm. What did you find? Look. Oh, my gosh. It is really cute. Did you see what I found? No. Oh, my goodness. It's Abraham it Lincoln. It certainly is. He's a sun catcher. He is. And you found a pony. I, I, look, this, <laughs> this is a great looking pony. Let me straighten it out is. this little saddle. And he's even got stirrups. If Juliet were just a few inches short, <laughs> she could probably A few inches. Little... Uh... Well, all right. A lot of <laughs> she could... Oh, this is going to have to go home for her. Just... And we'll send this home for Ashton. Abraham Lincoln. I think I'm going to pull the pink scarf off. Don't anybody say anything. <laughs> because I had seen this before and thought Ashton might like it as a bank. Ah, but not with a pink scarf. No. Probably so don't not. anybody say anything. Boys, <laughs> if, they, if they knew there was ever a pink scarf at any time on it. Yeah, it would just ruin it. Just, you know, That's exactly right. It's got right. cooties. So, 
What do you think? Do you think he'd like it? I think he'd like it. I think because he would. I put it back because of the pink scarf. Yeah, just rip that thing off. Yeah, that's exactly and what I'm And this, do. Sue found this for me. That's just a sweet little That's thing astounding. Thing. Thank you, Sue. Like, you don't want it? She's like, nope, it's yours. I'm like, wow, what are friends for? That's just beautiful. It looks like it's even got some, um, what is that? <laughs> Abalone? Yeah. It's, is that the word I'm looking yes. for? Yes. <laughs> you work yes, off. Abalone, like a, <laughs> it's a mother of pearl. Yes. Abalone. Sure, I love it. That's a nice piece. I it is. Really is. Are you sure you don't just, want it? I'm positive I picked that up for you. <sighs> Thank you. Um, I was Best day up, ever? I had some interesting things. Uh, I'm not sure if any of this is going to grab you. But this I did see some interesting stuff in here. I think this is supposed to be Miss Pris. <laughs> Left in Miss Pris. Put it with the Halloween stuff. Now I did see a clock back here. I don't do much with clocks because clock people are tough. Oh, it's chalkware. I thought it was wood. Never mind. Definitely don't oh deal my. in clockwork. Clockware. Chalkware clocks. Chalkware clocks. Yes. That's a tongue twister. Don't yes. attempt it. But that is called the clock. <laughs> Oh, aren't those neat? Yeah. See those? Those are like really cool pieces of art. I don't get them. Here. It's got a friend. Got friends. They're not signed or anything. No Does that way. make them like just regular? This has to. Well, that one's signed. Oh, huh. I'm B. Harris. I don't know. I think. I like those. Those are like fun, monochrome, interesting mid-century pieces. Yeah. I'm gonna go with it. Heck yeah. Wait, maybe over here. Oops, watch out for Abraham Lincoln. I'm buying a lot of artwork lately. It's out of control. Kind of like my mug situation. Well, here's the thing. <sighs> I actually pull this little guy out of here. There we go. Thank you, Sue. No problem. The great thing about artwork is it doesn't take up a lot of storage space. Just bang a nail in the wall and say, there you go. Yeah, right on. I don't know why it's in the Halloween section. I kind of, <laughs> I kind of, oh man. <laughs> and a hat. Oh. A very orange hat. This is a high visibility hat. It is. This is a hat you could wear out walking and people will not hit you with their car. That's exactly. So is this one. I would prefer that one, honestly. I think you should get that one. It this says ya yeah, ya yeah. sisters. Yes, please do. That's the one. <laughs> oh, that's great. I don't even know if this stuff is supposed to be stuck the way. <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh my this gosh. Stuff. Yeah, yeah, sisters. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> oh my so gosh. New York Yankees hat, which we should just spit on and quickly. Oh no, Shh, you can't say that. <laughs> I expected this to be that Hocus Pocus book. But then I picked it up and I'm like, oh no, that's actually some nice copper work. It's signed Pat. And the book itself, I believe, has some actual age to it. We were flipping through it and the paper is like old. I don't know. I think it's a really nice piece. You can put your, your photos from your visit to Cancun in there. We're going to grab it. Eek, maybe. Ta-da. Okay. Ta-da! We love burlap bags and I just found one in the sea of purses. So we're gonna go through the purses real quick. This is kind of our last stop and then we're gonna get out of here. What is that down there? Oh, nothing good. I've just spotted this in this sea of junk and had to share it with all of you. Is that the Geico, Geico? I'm, I'm almost positive it is. <laughs> oh my goodness. 
it shall be immortalized in my video in case nobody else buys it. Let's get out of here. And this is us paying for our stuff, right Casey? That's right. Because we pay for stuff. All the time. All the time. Oh, I'm recording. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yes. Well, we are in the shady parking lot. Yes. And I was just telling Jocelyn, I think this is where guys go when their girlfriends break up with them because we have seen folks in here having like breakdowns in their car. Yeah. And the guy next to us was just drinking. I don't know. We don't even know what he, he was drinking in his and car. And he was smoking That's a something. That's a no-no. Don't do that. <laughs> he was not smoking a cigarette. You don't smoke oh. a cigarette for like five minutes. It's just, they, they just don't, they burn down a lot quicker than that. <laughs> Believe it or not, it's an anti-arson thing. Oh my gosh. Yes, no, really it is. I could explain it to you, but I don't want to <laughs> because this is not the how to commit arson channel. Um, okay, what channel is this, so? <laughs> oh, well, this is, this is, yeah, well, it's not the how to commit arson channel. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. But actually, it's an anti-arson thing that cigarettes burn down quickly. Hmm. Yeah. Um, anyway, we just left the Goodwill, and I think we got we got some pretty good stuff there. I am satisfied with our Goodwill run. It wasn't Me too. overwhelming. Um, I got a couple of project pieces. Just got a couple of really interesting things. We got an adorable horse for Juliet. Yes. And a duck for Ashton. And nobody tells Ashton there was a oh, pink no. scarf on that duck that's ever. Right. <laughs> you know, we just pretend that never happened. Never happened. That's right. All right. All right. Um, so make sure you stay tuned tomorrow for the haul video where we talk about what we got and what we paid for it and how much we expect to get for it on eBay. And don't forget to go check out Sue on her channel, that's, Sue Me. Yeah, that's where the projects are Yes, are that's going. where the projects are going. So you'll be able to see that lamp project she bought today. And uh, yeah, we will see you guys later. Yes, we will. Bye. Okay, before I end this video, I just wanted to add a quick note that <laughs> most of you know that my dad is a pastor and his congregation is currently moving into a new church building. It is a 1700s church that they will be renting from our local arts council. Now, the local arts council is running an auction to raise funds for a lot of the arts programs that they have and for upkeep on this church because it is a really old church and it needs to have a little TLC. So I've agreed to donate two vases uh, to auction <laughs> and the funds of which will go towards their programs and their fundraising. So I'm going to be auctioning off these art glass vases. They are custard vases. They glow on UV. I'm going to be auctioning them off on my eBay site over the next five days. Uh, today is October 10th, 2019. It will end on October 15th, 2019. But you can go check that out over on my eBay. There's a link down below. Simultaneously, they are running their own auction on a website, which I've also linked down below. They have lots of really nice artwork, uh, watercolors. They have some other odds and ends, some antiques, I do believe. Uh, but that auction is ending on October 19th, 2019. So you can go check that out. Uh, again, the link is down below. But the proceeds from all of these auctions are going to their programs and their mission. So go check that out. Links are down in the description and I'll see you guys later. My family calls it my superpower. It's my ability to see value in things that other people might overlook. <laughs>